Hey guys, welcome back to another DNA video. Today we're going to be looking at the Realm Aquarium at the Realm at Castle Hills. Sean's going to show us how it works. All right. So we set this aquarium up. It's the largest freshwater that we've ever actually built. Planet had to build it on site. Uh, we, there's a steel stand at the bottom that's covered by this it's covered by this facade, but there's, that's a 10 by 10 steel stand. So what we had to do is we had to bring the steel stand in, set it in place before they even had anything basically constructed. And then Planet came back and over two weekends, they actually brought the glass panes in, brought the, the steel um, frames in also and built it on site. So when we set it up, we put in, we've got two hammerhead bolts that run two large custom sumps that were made by planning. Did the gimbal die? No, it lost. Uh... So this is all controlled by an Apex EL that we have set up to give us alerts and to read the temperature, pH, everything obviously an Apex can do. It's also got a large, a large, large top off that it's a 55 gallon reservoir with an ATK on it. So if you just want to maybe get some wide shots of the fish. So it's a mixed cichlid tank, so we didn't go purist on this one. We went with mostly African cichlids, but as you can see, there's clown loaches, there's blood parrots, and there's big silver dollar, big school of silver dollars up there. They all get along because it's such a huge tank. I wouldn't recommend this in a 75 <laughs> gallon. How, about how many fish are in here? Uh, Maybe, maybe 120? They all think I'm gonna feed them. I'll feed them real quick. <laughs> it's on an automatic feeder too. There's two Apex automatic feeders, but they appreciate food too. Good. Yeah. They're all very happy, as you can see. And then if you pan out, you can see the. We put 24 Kessel 360X Tuna Suns. And they're all on one hardware controller, just so they all, we make sure they all work all the time. So we had to come out here and mount all of those. Get, let me get the ladder and you can get a uh, aerial view of the converters <laughs> and all that stuff. Big Fantosa. So the, the Atlantis insert was done by a company called Rock and Reefs that we contract with to do some of our kind of cool, they can do anything. So the owners of this office building chose to do an Atlantis theme. So you can see that it's got lots of, there's one of our janitor guys. It's also maybe got some Mayan stuff going on too. <laughs> yeah, just a bit. And what are the dimensions of this aquarium? 10 feet by 10 feet. Wow. Square, about 30 inches tall. So it's a 2,000 gallon. 
Yeah, it looks cool. <laughs> yep, so there you go. I think the next video we probably need to do is going to be of a reef tank, but we haven't decided yet. Now that we've got the correct gimbal and phone and all that uh -huh. good stuff to do it. So. All right, guys. Well, thank yeah. you for watching, and we'll see you next time.